It's reckoned we spend a whopping £30 billion a year on this stuff. There's no getting away from it. We Brits simply love our takeaway. But forget the good old pizza or the late night doner kebab. The most popular takeaway in the United Kingdom is Chinese. Mm. This fast food from the Far East is so popular that even master chefs are opening Chinese takeaways. Larkin Ken was a finalist in the 2013 series. And last year, he spent £200,000 opening Hokkei, an upmarket takeaway in Cardiff's student district. Why a Chinese takeaway? I've been walking up and down the street. There's literally hundreds of takeaways. That's right, but they all do the same thing. What we do is we source responsibly, we produce everything naturally. I think that goes a long way. You know, you have to be different to the other takeaways if you want to survive. Larkin's food tastes great. But his takeaway dream could be boiling away to nothing. Takeaways, 50% fell in the first year. And uh, we almost got to that stage. You know, in January, we had £12 left in our account. Um, but, you know, I always believed in the business. OK, so you're breaking even now, but you've blown a huge amount of cash. Absolutely. I take a minimal amount out of the business anyway, but the last two months have been hard and, um, you know, that's meant that I can't take anything out because, you know, ultimately our suppliers and our staff have to be paid. Larkin's aiming to produce quick quality cuisine at premium prices. But I'm not sure this posh Chinese is going to meet its true potential in this location. When you have a takeaway, what do you expect to pay? I know, about a fiver ash? I'd probably go for about £5, pound, £5.50. Pound £5. Pounds. It's a student area around here, so obviously budgets are a bit tighter. Mmm, Larkin's meals may be good, but they come in at around the £8 mark. I'm taking him to a Chinese takeaway in Cardiff that's got the combination of price and location absolutely spot on. And he should know it very well. It belongs to his mum and dad. Hello. Hello. <laughs> we come over here 33 years ago. From China? Um, from China and okay. opened this business. You've seen so much in 30 years. So what advice would you give him? Uh, I keep talking to my customer. Right. And so I listen, I try to improve it, and I think that's one of the, one of the secrets, and we have been here for so long, yeah. What do you think? Will it be a success? <laughs> and I'm keen to learn the hand too. Mrs P has all the kids in our house. In fact, she asked me to boil a kettle the other day and I burnt it. OK, what you need to do now, you need to start tossing it. I'm never going to do that. I'm going to get everywhere, look. Hey, look, techie. Look the concentration of getting this together. Right, so you put the soy in. Which that one? Some more. How much? A little bit. More. <laughs> and then I've got the... Can you plate up into there? The concentration, I've got to tell you. <laughs> I've never concentrated so much in my life. That's one done. Now, how many more to go? Ten. Enough of my culinary clowning around. It's time to get serious about hockey, as even though he's struggling, Larkin already has plans to expand his takeaway empire. The reason why I brought you to this empty shop is that it could potentially be a next hockey outlet. You're going to open another shop before you prove concept in your first one? Well, I believe the concept is proven. So do you think this is a bad option for us? Well, I don't think it's your best option. That's for certain, because I'd want to be in an affluent suburban area where I had prolonged trading day and a better chance of success. I think this is just too much of a gamble. Yeah, yeah. I love Larkin's passion, drive and ambition to be successful, but I'm just concerned that he's trying to run before he can walk, and that, believe you me, is a recipe for disaster. So, will Larkin listen to my advice, or will he press on with his city centre expansion? I'll be back later on in the year to see if his fast food revolution's a success. <laughs>